farming to boost Zimbabwe's economy and improve food security. Hello viewers, thank you for watching our weekly news bulletin, courtesy of Huey TV, I'm Ronia Chimbertete. Fish farming ambassador in Zimbabwe, Dr. Afra Nanangas Aquaculture, improves Zimbabwe's food security ahead of the SADAC's target to have every Zimbabwean consume 6.7 kg per capita against the current 2.5 kg. Today, scores of people from TBD visited Arden Farm to learn about fish farming and harvesting, which saw them learn a lot from a woman who started from zero to be a fish farming ambassador with over 150,000 fish in over six fish ponds. Addressing TBD members, she emphasized using social media as a good source of networking, not just for luxury social charts, but for business. Let's hear her speak. I am on a journey. I created my own university. Mm. A national university where you can apply for BIMA. Kuruto wa mama diploma wa nava chenda wa mwaruku kuirande gegreta aqua culture. But I said I will create my own at my own place. Mm. Social media ino endwa but ino endwa for a reason. Kuna shinu chinonzi network. Network it's not about my chinamo doctor Afra and pay one ingrini for number yeyu. Phone number, I'm going to go with It's not just a matter of checking my phone number. Yeah. Check you my conduct. I remember phone number I got in day. Mama, I shall chat to you. Never to walk and go tour. For no reason. So I can my con my conduct. I do. I no find my good drama relationships. That's the use of conduct. Gazira munu wa sanga na na ewa watu ndi po phone number. Make sure wa kutu upita relationship ni munu ye. Emphasizing on time management in her profile, Dr. Nananga said uh, people should avoid the last minute rush as everyone is given 24 hours a day and we are competing against time. Opening court, if you rush, you crash. A close court. A prosper kandemiri reporting for Wuwi TV at Arden Farm in Karoi. In whatever business, yet today's business woman ya true kuita even in nini as a farmer. Be quick to respond. Negoti time yoyo yoyo kunwe umu anayo mese muru kukum kombi tam 24 hours. Sapa tru kombi tam 24 hours ga pano mwa snache kumirira. Saka yuwa ucha gara uchienda kuno batu kwa msoro ni ma profits. Ushi gara uru mabani. Ushi ti namo yangu yi namo yako namo yako yi ripa time. As Zimbabwe is rated number seven in terms of fish production and at 2.5 kg per capita in terms of fish consumption. And the volume has reduced due to overfishing in uncontrolled lakes and dams through the continuous use of fishing nets as people collect everything that comes into their nets, including finger rings and eggs. More from our field correspondent. To mitigate fish instinct in Zimbabwe, Mr. Sokonia Kaitano of the Big Three is taking his precious time training people on aquaculture, which saw TBD members are participating in harvesting the Nilotikas oreochromis, are commonly known as the Nile tilapia. I'm talking about fish husbandry. Mu fish do mune protein you know kosher in on the omega-3 fat acid. Tilatu muone gap regi, red demand within our own country. Satan desa fish gubi. Kunze kwe nyika. Tilikunzi, tinofani rwane nyika to manage to produce about 60,000 metric tons per gore. Kutitinzi, takwalisa kupamunu 6.7 g kg. So if we are producing less than 20,000, which means it's in a deficit of more than 40,000. That's why I'm sure there is a cry. Unomu nyika kuti, please go into fishy. Farming, go into fish, farming. farming. Maybe we can cover this deficit. The reason they put it, we are not cooking down, madam, manitiga. We are not butter on our mind, we are not masai. We are not butter net, we are now. That's what the future is. Future is the washing go, washing go butter. So that's why it's a good thing. My volumes, aroma, demo, my seeds, press are doing the le. So that the only way to mitigate. Pan, 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 zika, pan, zika, is to go aquaculture way. 
SADC requires every Zimbabwean to consume 6.7 kg per year to improve its food security, yet we are producing less than 3,000 metric tons per capita, which is below the average. And let's hear him speak. Kuroti kana kuna asiri kuja pa gore fish. <laughs> but Sadak, because Zimbabwe is under Sadak, Yakapua target mu Sadak region, Kuti Zimbabwe, Kuti Titi Murinani pa food security. Please manage Kupa Munwega Wega 6.7 kg per capita. Kuti munuwege nga kwa niso kuambu uja waka na 6.7 kg pa gore. Zunenge nani, anu ito waka ya wati kariji? Kari nani. Asipa 6.7 kg isi suru kwa niso only 2,5. Catch them young phrase is put to use at Arden Farm as we caught up with some of the young girls who have been taking part in the production of fish at Arden Farm. I know about the foods fish is, we start by Starter, we do start one, start two, start three, then we go to Javana, then we do Javana one, Javana two, grows, then harvester. And so I know that if if the fish, if there is no mazerere in the water of fish, you have to remove it because after that, in the day, they give. They give the fish oxygen, but in the night after that, they'll get the oxygen back. I'm willing to help my parents expand more in the fishing business, and hopefully we get somewhere since it's quite an amazing industry to be in. I'm grateful, and for my parents for helping me um, learn more and experience um, things outside my comfort zone because I wasn't really into farming at first but now I feel like I'm more comfortable coming out here and just bonding with nature. I was also interested in um, catfish so we've been told what to do about catfish and why catfish is not so popular but I think I will try it at some point. I would like um, to give an applaud to Miss Nananga because uh, I've learned that if you want something, go for it. Just make a move from wherever you are, because we've got to work in June. June. It's winter time, and when I was it, but then she told herself that she's got to do it. And from what we have seen, the harvest here, it was more fish. So if you want something to happen, go for it. This is empowering women to be able to come up with business ideas, to be able to look after themselves, to be able to look after their families, and even contribute towards the economic development of the country. When I started this aquaculture project in 2021, I said this place is going, is going to be a learning hub for women, for the youth, so that we can impart knowledge to other people, so that our country will become a better country, a better world. And fish farmers are special people in society. They say catch them young. I've seen little girls, your own children, participating in uh, this uh, uh, fish harvesting. What do you have to say? I was really excited that I'm leaving a legacy. I always tell people that my children, they're not eggs. They don't break. You saw them joining men my girl children, three of them, they joined men in the fish pond to also to participate in fish harvesting. So I was really excited and happy as a mother. That's all we had for this week's news bulletin. I'm Ronia Chimbatete. Keep on watching Huey TV. Goodbye.